up everybody it's your boy sitke bunny coming away with another tutorial and it's been quite a long time i'm back again and today i'm going to give you psd files for free and i want you to use it for your projects without further delay let me just show you the files that i have to give you these are the files one two three four and then five okay so on these are five files now this church flyer this is a cool store flyer this is also a church flyer and then this is a more like a church event flyer this is also an all night flyer and uh, you start to have all these stuff now it is password protected i don't want you to skip this video and then just go for the file the password is going to be in this video i'm going to divide the password into three okay i'll, I'll show the first password and then i'll show the middle of it and then i'll show the last um digits of it okay and so and the password are all in capital letters guys watch out for it watch the video throughout and get it all right so now this is the first one let me show you how to to use this all right so this is how it looks like and i want you to look at how you can see how the text is is 3d really really epic one and first what you want to do is you want to hide this one okay let me delete that one you want to hide this one uh, once you hide it now you can be able to start uh you know working on it this is all the background okay so you can see it over here let me drag this up okay so let's close it let me show you everything you stand to get everything you stand to get once well, now i start with the background you can see how i did it and everything is in there i masked everything in the background nicely like that and then i brought in the markers there and then i brought in the name or the theme of it that one you can also click on it and then begin to work on it all right so you can double click here and then you can just put it here now if you want to get this text guys there's a video i'm going to link it in the description how to get this 3d text and then you'll be able to use it as well okay so once you do that um i want you to come here and then bring that one also over there and then bring this one there okay and then that one and then um, you know that one and then that one everything is totally customizable guys customizable everything is customizable all right everything is customizable you can see it and then i brought in those shapes as well there and then i i made everything into you know smart objects and i converted into a camera row now how to do that is uh, make sure this one is invisible click over here and then Control alt shift and then e you know how we do it and then i want you to Control c to copy it and then double click here okay now you can see this is the old one Control v to paste it. you can see the new one just came on top of it okay once you save it to show you it is saving and then once it's done um just close it and there's going to reflect over here so this one we can delete the one underneath it now this is the smart object you can see everything here like that now it looks epic and more nice that's how i use my smart object all right so um uh, so this for this particular one let's go to the next one also the next one is a cool store cool store this is also very easy to edit if you do not have the fonts you would be able to easily look at the fonts and download them online okay so as usual what we first want to do is to hide the smart object okay and then let me show you how i created it and how you can also edit it okay you can double click it and change the background to any color you want any color you want okay that's what that is it for the background here and then i brought in the boxes now i brought in the boxes because you can see i grouped all the boxes this one is for that that one is for that this one is for that to neatly arrange everything okay so when i open one of the boxes you can see we have the outer black one and then we have the image here all right and then we have that one here okay so what you can do is just bring here your image and then clip it to it right click it and then release clipping mask okay and then right click it and then create clipping mask to clip it away okay which one is this one this one is also for the egg you can see once you open it we have the black outer one there and then we have the egg okay so you can right click it and then release clipping mask you can see it has released the egg is showing there like that you can right click it and then create clipping mask so you can drag your object in there and then clip it to it it will be very nicely put like that we have the shapes here i, I created some shapes shape beneath the shape on top and then these lines you know to give it more beauty and then i brought in 
these stuff over here as well now these stuff are randomly arranged there okay you can also replace them if you want to and then the names of each one of them you can see how i place them there the names are also totally customizable you can go there and re-edit them because i labeled each and every single one of them okay so you can go there and then double click on it and then just change the name over there and then i put in the the, the no the name of the coast or, or logo whatever it is okay so now this one then that one are the ships over there and then this one is the word itself and the font i used is wicked mouse so you can easily use wicked mouse to also do that if you don't have it just go and download it and then you'll be able to have access to it and then i brought in the telephone numbers and stuff now once you are done Control alt shift and then e to create this now this is already mute to create everything sum up everything on one layer for you and then Control c to copy it double click this one and paste it in there and then save it and then close it once you are done closing it i want you to delete the one you just created and then this is the smart object it's going to work the colors are going to be pushed that up it's going to be more crispy more interesting and more nicer okay so um that's one of the ways of doing it and then we also have this now these are all epic banners and flyers and artwork okay so guys if you love this video hit the bell icon and subscribe to this channel as well already you can see um you know these are quality stuff so i don't know the kind of program you have it's not pre yes you can just change the text to suit uh whatever whatever program you have everything is customizable okay now remember what we do is we always hide the smart object uh, we always hide the smart object okay so what we've done Control alt shift and then e to copy everything come in here place it in there Control t and then Control s to save it you can see save once you're done and then um now you can close it let's delete the one we just created and then that is for you you can see how beautiful it is okay so everything down here is all customizable everything down there is customizable and then we also have this and then we also have this i created all these stuff for more um, for clients and they loved it and so i believe you can also re-edit it now, guys when i give this to you I want you to change stuff okay change the background change the colors change some things change the details and then re-upload them online or you can give it to your clients i'm not going to hit you in the copyright okay so now this is it if you love it hit the bell icon and subscribe to this channel as well and remember i love you all guys see you in the next video